Nicola Roberts of Girls Aloud is engaged. The singer, 38, proposed to her partner Mitch Hahn, 36, over the weekend at Brighton Pride, and she proudly displayed her enormous diamond ring. Recent sources state that her football player fiancé proposed to her last month while on a romantic vacation in the south of France. According to a source, Nicola has found her sole match in Mitch. She is ecstatic beyond measure. Nicole performed on stage with her colleagues, Kimberly Walsh, 42, Cheryl, 41, and Nadine Coyle, 39, flashing the sparkler. Nicola and Mitch, a semi-professional football player and accountant, were first seen together at an Elton John performance in June 2022. At the European Maccabi Games in Israel, her fiancé captained the Great Britain squad while playing for the Essex Team Greys Athletic. Nicola last dated Charlie Fennell in the public eye for six years, ending their relationship at the end of 2013 with a statement that it had fizzled out. She had a brief relationship with Carl Davies before this, from which she experienced a campaign of internet harassment after the relationship fizzled out. He was found guilty of stalking Nicola, but was spared jail time in exchange for a restraining order. After creating 35 fictitious social media profiles and sending thousands of messages, she was subjected to harassment that included threats to burn and stab her. More than four years after their breakup, he went after the pop diva. Nicola carefully copied every message and gave it to the police, but she never responded to any of them. After he acknowledged threatening to kill former BBC Breakfast presenter Louise Minchin and rape her daughter, he was later sentenced to two years and eight months in prison. On the first day of the well-attended event at Preston Park, Girls Aloud was the main attraction. On Sunday, the concerts will conclude with the chart-topper Mika. The Love Machine hitmakers thrilled the crowd with a fantastic set list that included hits like Watch Me Go and a performance of The Loving Kind with Eurovision star Ali Alexander. A version of Madonna's massive hit song Material Girl was also performed. Sensations of Unreal and Absolutely Incredible were expressed by fans as they flocked to X, previously Twitter, to hail the incredible headline act, finally watched girls aloud live at Brighton Pride. They weren't real. As inconceivably incredible as hashtag Brighton Pride hashtag Fabulosa, wow, Girls Aloud's performance at hashtag Brighton Pride was incredible. The female trio concluded their 20th anniversary reunion tour last month with an exclusive O2 priority show in London, and now they are performing at Pride. The girl ensemble played 30 dates total while touring England, Scotland, Ireland, and Northern Ireland between mid-May and the end of June. The group's first tour without Sarah Harding was called Girls Aloud Show, and each show honored her. Girls Aloud performed their hit songs with visuals and even Sarah's vocals mixed in. In their 2008 hit song The Promise, Sarah's notorious, Walking Primrose, Bridge was a noteworthy addition. When Sarah's mother Marie saw the group's performance in Manchester, Sarah's hometown, it was quite touching. Sarah said that she had been diagnosed with breast cancer a year before she passed away at the age of 39. Regretfully, the cancer regrettably expanded to other parts of her body. Sarah moved in with Cheryl and her son Bear, whom she shares with Liam Payne, during the last few months of her life. After Sarah passed away, Nadine, Cheryl, Kimberly, and Nicola decided to grant her final request and go on a tour in her honor. The girls allowed shows profits, which were entirely sold out, were given to the Sarah Harding Breast Cancer Appeal in order to assist raise much-needed money for illness research.